hello guys you're welcome again to my educational youtube channel where i talk about tech and i talk about coding and show you how to do some cool stuff so if you like this kind of content that you're gonna watch now hit that subscribe button like the video so that youtube can recommend this channel and video to many other people and of course tell me what you think in the comment section below now in this, today's video i just want to show you how you can host your site your react website or any other website free of charge on netlify netlify is a very cool platform where you can host your site you can of course host it free of charge share your cool project with people around the world first of all look at the site i just developed i just built this simple site for a news app that i created using react native so i'm a react native developer so so how do i do this come over to my projects on visual studio code open up my work now let me show you how to open up the terminal first of all if you're new so i'm using a windows operating system if you're using a mac just google how to do this how to open up terminal on your visual studio code it's just out there on google for you so for windows you're gonna hold down control key and then you click on the first key before one so it's going to open up this terminal for you so from this terminal you can start running various commands from here so the first thing you can do is to create a build folder okay for your project and when you can see here from my own project i already have a build folder but i've done some modifications to my website and i want to upload on netlify okay i actually have this project hosted on netlify but i'm going to redo it again so that you see how it works okay so but each time you do some modifications on your website and you want to update it okay you still have to do this npm npm run build and you click enter and you can see it's giving me an error is saying there is a missing script build now the problem the reason why i have this is because i did not navigate into the main folder that contains my website so i'm just going to do cd just get news up and I'll do enter now I have navigated into the just get news app folder now I can now say npm run build because this is where the, the build um, script is located now when I click on enter it's now running okay it's running the script uh, React script build is creating optimized production build you can see can follow what is doing here at this lower part so let's just give it a little bit of time now it has done it is done you can see the build folder is ready to be deployed you may save it to a static uh, server this is if you want to save this to a static distance but that's really not the main thing for me now the main thing is that i want to open up the the folder where this build folder is located because this is what i'm going to drag into netlify now so i'm going to right click i'll say reveal now when i click on reveal in file explorer let me maximize this you can see my build folder is here it's just 2.30 megabytes in size now we are going to have to go back to our browser and come over to netlify sites if you haven't signed up before just go ahead and click on sign up and when you click on sign up you will be able to you see it's taking me to my own folder because i already have an account with the the site if you don't have an account just click on that sign up you can sign up with your email you can sign up with your google account or you can sign up with even your github account so for me i'm already here and i want to add new sites you can see i have some other sites deployed already but i want to add new site just to show you how this works so if i click on add new sites this button here is going to show you some options for me i want to just deploy manually so i'm going to click 
deploy manually once you click deploy manually you can see this beautiful interface here asking you telling you a couple of things that you can do but the main thing is that you can drag and drop your build folder into here and your site will go online so remember my file explorer that i opened where my build folder is you can see inside my gsgate news app folder i have a build folder here that we just generated so i'm just gonna drag this a bit this way so that i can see this folder and also see this interface now all i have to do is to drag hold down with my left button on my mouse drag it and you can see once you bring your, your folder here it comes alive right like an avatar kind of something and so I just drag it on drop it there and allow it to do its thing just let it do its thing all right it's uploading and voila your site is active already you have um, a name for the site generated okay we have some other options you, you can walk around here you can learn about but the main thing is that when you click on this open production deploy now you can see your site is now live <laughs> it's so simple like that your site is now live and everything you've done is right here and is online and you can actually copy this link and share it with your team or whoever you want to show the site okay but if you feel this link is too long all you have to do come back here go back to your deploys okay now you can see the main link of this site just copy it come over here you can close this open a new tab paste this click enter you can see this funny url now but it ends in netify.app here so you can see my site is uploaded my react website is uploaded with everything working fine as expected fine as programmed so that's simply how you can do this let me know what you think in the comment section below and uh, if you have other experiences about this and of course hit that subscribe button hit that like button and share this video so that other people can get to benefit from it make sure you subscribe to the channel i create amazing tutorials about how to do various things especially how to program and how to code and how to solve some life's challenges in the tech world so do me a favor subscribe to the channel and it will make me very happy and inspired to create more content my name is anato green of anato tech youtube channel you can follow me on twitter on instagram and other social media at anatotech see you on the next one namaste